right, hey VC, Jeff here. So, it's Friday. I have the day off. I figured I'd knock out some uh, a contest video or two. I have one ready now, and I have another one that I'm working on. I uh, might do another a regular video after this because I did have a couple things coming this week, and I have a couple, I don't know, at least one thing that may come in today. Um, today is my anniversary, my wedding anniversary. Yes, I know. You say, Jeff, you just had a birthday on Tuesday. Yes, I did. Interestingly enough, I got married right after my birthday. So um, I had just turned 20 and I had gotten married. So my wife wasn't even 20 at the time. Anyway, she said something this morning about maybe we should make a video together about our music. So anyway, I don't know. That may or may not happen. Uh, I just figured I'd go ahead and mention that at this point while it's, it's going on here. Um, yes, yeah, so today is my 35th wedding anniversary. So anyway, get on with the contest. This is for Vinyl Dale. He just hit 300 subscribers and he's having a contest. It's fairly easy, but as he mentioned, maybe not everybody can do this. It all depends on how uh, much of a collector you are. But he wants to see three formats of a single release. Now, he only wanted to see one. I grabbed a couple just because I only have a couple that I would qualify. So I figured I'd show a couple. Um, first one I'm going to show, and this is basically three different media formats of the same release. Um, and I was thinking about it. I guess, you know, if it was a... I have one that I thought about was a soundtrack. And I'm like, well, I have the CD of the soundtrack and the record and the movie. But I don't know. Anyway, I'm not going there. That's another one I could have done. Um, first one I'm going to do is Deliverance, Greeting of Death. We have the cassette. We have the CD. And we have the vinyl. Now, I know, I know, for those of you who are in the know, you're saying, but wait a minute, Jeff. That was just released a couple months ago. It's not fair. Yeah, I bought them as a pack. Yeah, I mean, this is, I had this cassette back in 1980, you want to say 87? Yeah, okay, 87. I had this original cassette back in the day, so I'm going to count that. But this was a reissue, they put it on cassette. It was never on CD, so this is the first time on CD officially like this. The tracks have been released on CD, and of course it was never on vinyl, so this is the first time. But I'm going to, okay, so fine, we don't want to call that one because, you know, that just came out and that's not fair so let's go back into 1984 with the first striper album 1984 so we have uh this is the yellow and black attack this is the first edition that i bought back in 1984 black it's all the cropping's all messed up anyway got this but i liked it so much and of course cds went around back then and you wanted a copy that maybe didn't pop in everything so you buy a copy of the cassette this is my original cassette from 1980 probably bought it in 85 the cd finally came out in 19 it was the 1986 remix edition there really has never been an official cd version of that particular mix album but anyway i have the original cd version that came out on cd the first time so but wait there's more let's do one more only because we're going to go back a little further the 1984 and I've shown this a long time ago not too long ago I showed this this is Dirk wears white socks the first Adam and the Ants album now this is their 1979 release on do it records and I bought this probably in 80 well around the time Kings of the Wild Frontier came out because that was a release in America and then this was in the cassette bin and I don't know why because it's an import it's a UK issue the American edition of this had a different cover, different song order, slightly different songs. and But I found this and I thought I'm going to buy it. And I've had it ever since and I love it. Now, not too long ago, maybe a year and a half or so ago, I found the vinyl edition. Absolutely. This is one of the originals that has been reissued on white, which I wouldn't mind having. This is just black. But this is one of the originals. Uh, so maybe maybe a, a second or, or so repress, but still it would have been from the 70s to early 80s. And then again, I have the CD version of the American release with different cover and slightly different songs. They changed some songs around and got rid of some songs. But then in 2005, this nice little Adam Ants, Adam and the Ants remastered box series came out, which I absolutely had to have. And of course, it's got the original UK edition, original songs, all the seven inch bonus tracks, this is like everything you could get because he had some singles that came out before the album around the album and all of that's on here and it is absolutely a must-have 
for absolutely one of my favorite. It's got all of the different Adam and the Ant albums at that time, including the bonus disc of subs. You got Kings of the Wall Frontier, Prince Charming, and then you got Adam Ant's, uh, you know, friend or foe. It goes into his solo career. It's got Strip and Viva La Rock, and then it's got this redo, which is a bunch of demos. Absolutely a wonderful set for us Adam Ant fans. Anyway, so there you go. That's three with three, and so it's a 300 contest for Vinyl Dale. Go check it out. There will be a link below for the video you can check out. Join on the contest, and uh, anyway, thanks a lot, Dale, for this, and I guess I will see you all later. Rock on and rock hard.